Oh my god. Hello. They do. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Hey peeps! So welcome. It's gonna be a hell of a day. <laughs> I'm excited. We have a lot planned. So we had a huge day planned with someone that was flying in from Florida. They wanted to see the closet as well as invite me to be their special guest um, for a gala tonight. Well, I don't know if they're gonna make it to the gala either, <laughs> but they're definitely not making it here. So we just found out this morning. Yes, I got all glammed up, got my house ready, had my housekeeper come early, had Fab come, glammed up. Yes, oh. even Fab is glammed up because he was gonna be filming. Ooh, what do you have on today? Guess, uh, so those boots you had, I had to buy them for myself. Oh, see? I just love them. Um, Target, Target, mm. and then jacket is Louis Vuitton. Louis Vuitton, look at C. I pulled out all the stops for you today. I and like, look at you on your makeup. I know, it feels so good to be like kind of done. Oh, yes. There's a reason why we're glammed up and everything. It's because we were supposed to be entertaining someone this morning in my closet and filming it. Which isn't going to happen. <laughs> so, as you all know, a day in my life is never the same. Ever. Right, Fab? Ever. <laughs> So today it was supposed to be all about filming. Well, guess what? Ain't happening now. Ain't happening. <laughs> so we have to immediately change plans, change things in our head. But guess what? That's life. You know, you cannot get stuck going, this is the way it's going to be. And then when it doesn't come out that way, get all pissed off. You just go, okay, where's plan B? And then where's plan C and plan D, right? Yeah. Constantly change, 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 change. So with that said, um, I'm still probably going to that gala tonight. Fab decided that I need to have a different I look mm -hmm. than this. This is okay for today, which we're not doing anything now. <laughs> <laughs> but tonight he wants me to have a different eye look. Yeah, just switch it up a little bit. Make so, it a little bit more glam. So we're gonna go to the glam room and he's going to show us on his face because he doesn't have any eye makeup on yet. And um, we don't want to take mine off until it's time. Mm -hmm. um, so we're gonna go to the glam room and Fab's gonna show us a new eye look that he wants me to wear tonight. So yes, I know. So here we are in the glam room with this new adjustable table. Yes. Look at, look at. Mm. <laughs> Ooh, I'm not having to do anything, just push a button. <laughs> this is so great for filming, isn't it? So great. Love. We are in the glam room and Fab is going to teach us how to do this Eye. Yes, kind of what like a is it? kind of like a quick holiday glam look, and we're gonna be using the Celestial Thunder by Dominique Cosmetics, and we are gonna take these two warm shades right here in the crease, and we're gonna pop this beautiful shimmer shade on the lid. Mm, so it's gonna be super simple, super easy. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna take the Sedona Lace Brush and EB13. This is the perfect size to just kind of fit and hug that whole crease. You want something like this so you don't have to spend a lot of time blending. With this one brush, it's just one go and just ch -ch -ch -ch, and that's it. So I'm going to take a Lunar Eclipse, which is that soft orangey shade right there as kind of like a transition shade. And I'm literally just going to pop this right in the crease and blend back and forth. And you see the size, how it's like so perfect, it fits right up in there. So you know what I learned from Fab is, uh, see, I thought you could just like brush it on and be done. He's like, no, you have to blend it and push it into the skin. Yes. Otherwise, it's not gonna stay on. And I was like, oh. All right. <laughs> Correct. That makes sense. I mean, like, for all my years, I thought you just took a brush and kind of put it on there and walked away from it. Right, and a lot of people used to do that. They used to just go in and kind of just, there was no kind of like technique. No. But literally, if you just go in, I say there's two motions. There's the windshield wiping motion and circular motions. As long as you do those two motions, it doesn't matter in what order, you are guaranteed a blended eyeshadow. And it's gonna work it into the skin. Yep. So it doesn't just fall off. And literally, leave. that was it. Just one brush, wow, one eyeshadow. Same thing, pop it on the other side. The windshield wiper. That's yep. a good, that's a good. Because the windshield wiping motion puts it on and the circular motion blends it out. Blends. 
and boom, in two minutes, you already have eyeshadow on. Oh my god. And you look good just right there. Right? You don't have to do anything else, really. So because I'm extra and because you're going to <laughs> and because you're going to a gala, yeah. we always want some shimmer. I like to put on something sparkly on my eyes, whether it's highlighter or glitter, because when people see me, I want them to catch that glitter in my eyes right. and hopefully fall in love with me. Oh. So that's what I kind of like to do. So what I like to grab is a nice flat brush. Any flat brush will do, it doesn't matter. And I like to pick up some of that product. You know what color is that? This is Eternal Light, which is a gorgeous, kind of like icy champagne shade. And I like to pick some up on the brush. And a lot of people would like to do is kind of already go in the eyes. This which is, is not good. And this is a trick. I, I just learned this from Fab. If I go straight into the eyes with all of this, there's going to be a lot of fallout on this beautiful base that we just already put on. So grab your setting spray mm -hmm. and spray your brush. Kind of get it nice and coated so all of that can be nice and wet. Yes. And it'll just stick to the eyes and just go on perfectly. Like so. And you won't have all that fallout. Exactly. Oh and I like my. to just hug it right there in the crease <gasps> and literally just press on there. That's it. Nothing crazy. Isn't that amazing? Boom. That's the trick I always forget is to use the setting spray. And then to make sure it's blended, go in with that color again and just tap right here so it's nice and blended together. Wow. And boom. Mm -hmm. Oh. Ooh, this is okay. going to good. I have to steal this palette. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that great? You can come to work and still work in the makeup industry because yes. of, my, of my glam room and all of my brushes and all of my uh, product that I have here. And then you'll just grab a small pencil brush like this. And what I like to do is I like to grab a darker color and do it at the bottom so it looks more smoky. At the bottom. Yeah, so you. Essentially, I would have grabbed this color to be the same on top, but I'm just grabbing that bottom one. It's still in the same tones of the of the colors. Oh, under the eye. Yeah, and oh, I'm yes. just putting it under here so it looks nice and smoky. Yes. Because I still like want that fog mm -hmm. and the smoky eye. See? Mm -hmm. Ooh. Just pop on that color Ooh, like that. Nice and easy. And what a pretty fall color. Now, why does this still take me two hours to get glam? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Because I think he works so well <laughs> on his eyebrows. Definitely, I definitely. I, when when I've seen you getting ready here, yeah, and both of us are getting ready at the same time. Yeah, he takes a long time on his eyebrows. For me, my eyebrows have to be perfect, or else nothing else is gonna look good. Yeah. As long as the eyebrows are good, everything else can look like crap. But the eyebrows frame the face, shape you, and all of that. Ooh, that. Where, are we, where are we going? Where are we going? Yeah. So. There you go. This is how we're starting our day off because our day got screwed up. But guess what? We went up to plan B and now we're going to get ready to go to plan C. So plan C <laughs> is, um, remember on our Black Friday adventure, uh -huh. we ventured out to the malls to see what kind of crowds there were for Black Friday. Right. There were crowds. Yeah. <sighs> Big crowds. So we also said in that video that we would attempt to go back during the week. Uh -huh during the middle of the day and see if there's still that kind of a shopping crowd yeah. or if that was just kind of Black Friday, the weekend kind of crap because today is now Tuesday. Wednesday? Mm -hmm. Ooh, it's already Wednesday. <laughs> it's a Wednesday. Um, so it's the middle of the week. Yeah. It's going to be the middle of the day. Hopefully mm -hmm. people are working or whatever. So what are you going to see? And kind of the aftermath of what happened this past weekend. Right. Because it was insane. Right. So that's plan C. So we're going to jump in the car here and uh, Go see what the malls look like because we've got to take some stuff back because they gave us the wrong stuff the other day. Yeah. <laughs> we get all the way home and they didn't give us the right stuff. So we have a reason to go back to the mall. Yeah, to, really at least is. Nordstrom. Yeah. Because they gave us the wrong, you know, I love my uh, yeah, your foundation. La Prairie. And I literally went to get more La Prairie and I got, uh, I don't even know what I got. I don't know. I, I got a container. But it's the foundation. But it's not the liquid foundation that I asked for. Right. And I even showed her pictures of what I was wanting. You, oh, you did show her pictures. I did. I did. And I came up with this crap. So we do have a reason to go to the mall to at least Nordstrom's. But while we're there, we're going to just slip into the mall and see if it's yeah. as crowded Check as it out. Friday. What the hell, right? So here we go. Well, well, well. Looky here. 
It just looks like a normal shopping day, doesn't it? <laughs> yes. Oh my God. So weird. Remember the cars were clear out to here. All the way to here. Oh my God. So, okay guys. So this is the middle of the week. It's a Wednesday. It's the middle of the afternoon. And so we wanted to be able to show you guys how the parking lot is compared to Black Friday. They were out in force Black Friday, right? Yes. And I'm sure that whole weekend. Correct. So now the rush is over. So now it'll be interesting because now it's dead right now. Not mm -hmm. dead. I wouldn't say dead, but it'll be interesting. I'm sure this weekend, I, th I think the weekends are going to be the busiest for mm -hmm. Christmas shopping. For sure. But I know at least the week of Christmas, this place is packed and I'm sure it will be again. But yeah. it's interesting. So we've got to go into Nordstrom's to take something and exchange it. But we're gonna jump into the mall just to see how empty it is. Yeah, scope it out like last time. Because it should be pretty empty compared to what we're seeing now. Like, like, or so we think. The, the park. <laughs> Maybe they're all on the other side of the mall. Maybe they all parked on the other side of the Maybe mall. Maybe there's a good deal on the other side. <laughs> but yeah. So, anyways, let's go inside and see. Are we gonna be the mask patrol again? Yep. <laughs> that was so Look funny. How empty it is. I know. To that day. Definitely is a good a time normal, to shop. This looks like a normal day, like not even Christmas. Correct. Right? My god, so many cute holiday stuff. Right? Look at these! Oh my god. But such cute sets. What is this? Hang on. Uh, setting spray. Oh. Look at all these beautiful colors. So many cute holidays. All set. Look, do we need another hat? <laughs> you definitely need black. You know, I've been on these hat sprays, right? Ooh. I don't like floppy ones. Yeah, I, like I love the sturdy ones. Yes. That is cute. Oh, this is what you need right here. What? The shield. <laughs> <laughs> so do, do I not have to cover my mouth then? <laughs> I don't know the rules or anymore. Just for your eyes. I forget the rules. Well, I'm just saying, see? Like, I think you still have to wear the mask. Oh. So why do I need to wear all that shit? That's just more stuff to put on. No shit. More it's stuff like to sell you. To sell you. Uh-huh. You don't ever wear slippers, huh? Or hot yeah. shoes? No. <laughs> They're no. so cute though. So you wouldn't wear nothing like these? No, my feet get too hot. Like these? My feet get too hot. Look at these Uggs. You wouldn't wear any of these? My feet will get too hot. <laughs> Seriously. This... I can, I like being just in my flip flops. Yeah. My feet get way too hot. <laughs> And they're quite ugly. <laughs> like, look, there's no bin. Oh, they're hard. Why would you wear this? Oh, yeah, there's, there's no definitely not comfortable. like walking on a brick. <laughs> no. I'll wear these all day long. Oh, yes. Love these colors. Yeah, this is pretty. Yes. So pretty. The boots? So hot. 152 bucks. My bad. And you know me and boots. Oh, you love them. You're just an eight and a half. That's a little too Jojo Siwa for me. <laughs> I'd probably wear these more than those. <laughs> oh my those God, so cute. weird. Ooh, plastic. So what's the point? It's called a were you ever name. Were you ever an Ugg girl? No. You never wore Uggs? I have, I do have a Ugg uh, at home. Uh -huh. I mean, like one pair. And I, I mean, like, I... Periodically. But I, I'm, am I a fanatic? Do I have to have them? <laughs> and literally, in Texas, you get to wear them, like, once or twice a year. For a second. Would you wear these if I bought them for you? Mm -hmm. I'd pick a different shoe for, for you to buy if you're going to buy a shoe. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, uh, let's get over to <laughs> Little outfit of the day today. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that house. Ooh, all real. No implants there. <laughs> in the gym, working hard. Oh, yes. 
Wrap them up. Okay, let's go see what the mall looks like. <laughs> let's bet. I'm gonna bet. Let's bet. Let's bet a quarter. Okay. I'm gonna say it's dead as hell. Okay. You're gonna say it's. I'm gonna say it's pretty busy. Okay. No mask. No mask. And, and they're not eating. Just chilling. They were drinking. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> Remember all those lines over there? Yes. Like there was a lot of lines. There was lines here, up there, over here. Pretty dead. I know the last week of the Christmas, it's been, it's packed. Mm -hmm. It'll be interesting to see if it is this year. But um, for the most part, this is the best time to go shopping. <laughs> It really is. Midweek, middle of the day. No lines. No lines. And it's funny, look, there's a man talking to a customer. He does not have a mask. Oh. It's on his chin. Look at that. He's talking to a customer. Call him out. Look at it. And they're the ones that are handing out the samples that they want you to touch. And they're the ones. Ready, oh, man. look, there's another guy. Oh, he's giving All her a sample. Them. He's giving her a sample. No face mask on. Look at wow. that. Oh, Look at that. He's right in her face. Oh, oh touching. Touching. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh my god, I love that outfit. <laughs> You think it comes in your size? Oh, that is so perfect! <laughs> the Isn't pants with the white and the pink. Isn't that cute? Yeah. You still want those leggings? I still want those leggings, but look at these shoes. Oh! Just gonna take them off the mannequin. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Huh. Yeah, you, we have so many black people. Oh, oh my God. God. You should be selling them. Oh, my God. They're so cute with a black sweatshirt. They're cute. Oh, my God. Uh, <laughs> take them off that mask. I want them. Yeah, how much? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> that was funny. You know who we are? <laughs> exactly. I, I, love, I love using that line. <laughs> take those damn things off that mannequin and give them to me. Yes. Yeah. I'll buy them. Don't even Every, give them to me. Everything has a price. No, I don't, I don't want you to give them to me. I want to buy them. <laughs> so if I just walk through the mall with a glass... Yeah, you have it. You have immunity. <laughs> well, I don't have to wear a mask, right? Because right. I'm just walking through the mall drinking right. my coffee, right? Yeah. And I'm good to go. Yeah. The coronavirus isn't going to get me. Nope. Because I'm drinking. Yeah. It says we'll come back later. Oh, that's good to go. <laughs> so no matter what, I can go to a movie theater. Yeah. Just sit there with the coke in my hand. Uh huh. Coronavirus isn't going to get me. Nope. The coronavirus is sitting next to you watching the movie. <laughs> See, in a restaurant, I feel safe because you're socially distanced. Yes. The only person next to you is your family or exactly. whatever. But in the mall? Yeah. Movie theater? Grocery store? No. They say as long as you have a drink. Or... What? Huh? You're so cute. <laughs> oh yes, yes. Spotted. Spotted. At least, at least we're like this. With a mask. Yeah, at least we're not yeah. looking like shit. Though, right? but it's funny when they notice us, even when we're looking like shit. Yes. But uh, no. So I'm just saying, you can literally just walk through the mall with a coffee in your hand yeah without a mask because you're drinking a coffee correct wrong <laughs> we're that way now do what we're that way now no we're in this store no yes we always come in by pickup are you sure yeah. oh lord we always come in oh yeah yeah you're right you're right, you're right. Over here, we come in here you're right oh my god <laughs> today i think fab is a blonde <laughs> What did you do this morning that made me think you're a blonde? Oh, the pillows. So guys, he's so sweet. He goes to West Elm for me to pick up my 
Mongolian lamb pillows, right? Mm -hmm. And he walks in the door this morning with them. <laughs> and he said, did you order extra pillows? <laughs> and I'm like, no, why? And he goes, because there's three other pillows in here. And I said, those are the pillows. These are the pillow covers. <laughs> I could have swear they kind of like, you know how they ship mattresses that are like compressed, like yeah. tightened? Yeah. I thought they did that with the pillows. They did. Oh. <laughs> they were they were compressed and wrapped. Oh. But then you saw the pillowcases. Yeah. Yeah. Which the I pillow guess cases. you thought the pillows were in, but they yeah. weren't. So he thought I ordered three extra pillows, which I did not. <laughs> And so I, I said, I said, is this, are you having a blonde moment? Definitely. It's a blonde kind of day. You're excused. When I have makeup on, I just focus on <laughs> being pretty. <laughs> I'm like, just make sure you look pretty today. He's like, I'm only pretty. I don't have a brain. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you want beauty and brains. <laughs> <laughs> it's only one or the other. It's Can't too hold much. both. Too much. One or the other. So what's next? Can't have both. So we forgot the Best Buy stuff. <laughs> And we don't have time to go to the office. I'm gonna have to do that tomorrow. So we're gonna have to get home. I'll model my new boots. Yes. And call it a day, maybe, huh? So you guys keep putting those orders in. We're still fulfilling them. Yes. Check the description for so that. So remember, sale. guys. Remember, don't get hit, fam. So remember, guys. We're still having a sale on at Teresa Romer. Uh, Teresa Romer LLC. So you know you can pick up uh, pillows for ten dollars, candles for ten dollars coaching calls that are discounted yes. books that are discounted i mean come on get all your christmas shopping done in one shop right yes buy 10 candles spend 100 dollars, you're done boom link in the description got everybody a present for 10 i'm like seriously so <laughs> anyways link is in the description guys get over there we're gonna have that sell should we have it the whole month or should we cut it off this Ooh, week oh let's surprise them so make sure they well, keep def on. Definitely this week it'll continue because it was a, it was kind of a Black Friday, Cyber Monday kind of sale. We'll keep it going for the rest of this week. We'll decide if we want to do it any longer for the month or not. We'll have to decide. But anyways, guys, let's get back to the house. So you know how I love boots. Mm -hmm. You know how I love boots with a heel. This was a good buy. Yes. $165 with sales tax <laughs> for Vince Camuto. Really? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So, freaking amazing. Okay. Why should, why did she shove all this shit back in? <laughs> <laughs> it's like I left them out for a reason. Anyway. So you're going to ask me why did I have to have another pair of boots? Yeah, why? Well, you know I don't have anything that's matte black. Correct. So, when I saw these, I was like, ooh, nothing I have is matte black when it comes to a boot. Everything's kind of got a gloss to it or a shine mm -hmm, of some mm -hmm. kind, patent leather, whatever. Even though I'm not a patent leather girl, I don't mind it on a boot. These jumped out at me because of the uh, matte and this leather. Like, it's, and they just look comfy. They're really nice. The lady like, wow, you know what you got? And I'm like, mm. Mm hmm. Teresa gets in and gets out. So you don't play. I don't play. Keep my ass in there. You know, we didn't plan on buying boots. <laughs> we planned on just exchanging makeup. But these did catch my eye. And it was on sale. Nice. See? So hot. Cute, aren't they? Like, Love them. And comfortable. Like, literally, yeah. you could stay in these boots and walk around in these boots all day. Really? Yeah. So comfy. Stunning. <sighs> so, are we putting that special eye makeup on me now to get ready for the gala? Yes. Let's go do it. I did forget. <laughs> <laughs> so, let's pop in the glam room, and he's going to apply that little bit of amazing whatever he did to his eye, mm -hmm. to my eye, which... My eye already has a base on it. Um, so he's just gonna pizzazz it up for my little event tonight. Let's go. Okay. And we're back with our lovely little model here. <laughs> Thank you for coming in today. My makeup artist. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys saw earlier of the look I created here in my eyes. It's still on here, still popping. Yes. We're gonna transform your look from a nice day, neutral, you know, smoky eye. Yeah. And we're gonna amp it up. 
everything's right now is just nice and matte. Right. And we just want to like add some sparkle to the eyes. So I'm going to get another flat brush again. And I'm just going to dip into that shade in the palette. To work out the spray. Correct. Ooh, I'm learning. <laughs> Believe it or not, I do pay attention when makeup artists work on me. I take notes because that's how I'm able to actually do my makeup pretty much by myself most of the time. Absolutely. And it literally looks like a makeup artist has done it usually. Absolutely. I get a lot of compliments on my makeup. No, I totally agree. You definitely. So we're just going to go ahead and pop this on the lid just like we did earlier. And because we sprayed it, it's just going to go on perfectly on the lid. And the reason why I like to grab this shape is because it just hugs the eye perfectly. And you already get that shape for the lid for that shimmer to go on. I wonder how many Christmas parties are going to happen this year. Mm. Mm. Are you advertising at all to do makeup for Christmas parties? I was, but it's like, I don't even, I don't even know. know. I well, can advertise, but I don't even know if anyone's doing anything. But it's worth advertising for, though. Yeah, definitely. One hundred percent. Just say, put it out there and go. In case anyone's going to any, because there might still be some corporations or businesses that throw little events. Yeah. Because somebody, I read somewhere, somebody's having a corporate event. Oh, it's one of my girlfriends that has an event space. Yeah. They're already booked out for corporate events. So let's put some settings for now. So there's actually a new trick that I learned from JLo's makeup artist. Oh. And when you put on setting spray, you take a brush like this, a dual fiber brush, and when you have the setting spray on, you start buffing that in. What? And it's just gonna help refresh the makeup and keep a lot of that setting spray in use. So you're not just kind of like waiting for it to just dry in one spot. You're kind of using it and pushing it into the skin. I'll be darned. And where did you learn this? From the makeup artist is Harush, and she does Jado's makeup, Kim's, uh, Kylie's, and she shared this in a wow. Class. So you're just lightly. Mm-hmm. Like, uh, you're you're not using a lot of force. So what do you think? Do you think that day that I did those threads? Oh yeah, definitely. You don't need. You don't need as much contact on there. I know. You know to I'm sharpen like, your jaw. You naturally have that structure. So they literally did a thread here and a thread here. And then they did some sculpture right here. Which, I'm not kidding you, the sculpture was kind of painful for a week. Really? For a week. It, I didn't bruise on the yeah. outside, but on the inside, it felt like somebody had hit me in the jaw. Like, it felt so tender and mm -hmm. sore for a week. But I like the outcome. No, I love it. And you said they use strings? Oh yeah, we've done that. The, oh, we've done a video before with the threads. Yeah. I need um, I need ropes. Ropes. <laughs> I need ropes. Just. But people are saying, oh, we noticed something different about your face. Well, that's. No, 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 no. I think it's working. Yeah. So I'm gonna take. I think it would be easy. I'm gonna take storm dust, and we're just gonna reapply that to the eye. Do you remember the two motions I mentioned earlier? Windshield wiper. Mm-hmm. And circular. Yes. <laughs> Told you I take notes. <laughs> Don't have to tell me twice. Oh. Ooh. So guys, if you're in the Houston area and you're looking for a makeup artist that's safe. Book Teresa. <laughs> book Teresa. <laughs> no, don't book me. <laughs> book me for a coaching call. <laughs> yes. Oh wow, look at my eyes pop. Yeah, I love hey. that, that color really just like wow. If you're in the Houston area and you're looking for a makeup artist that you know is safe, that's not playing around with COVID, exactly. book him. Whether you got Christmas parties, family gatherings, or you're just going to go out for the night, you you just, or you just, you just want to look pretty and get a picture taken, whatever. Yeah. Even if you're just that? going to the courthouse, which a lot of marriages are like doing, yes. you still need your makeup done? You still need your makeup done. You still, still want photos pretty. taken? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hit me up. Mm -hmm. you looking glam. Mm -hmm. I have this other new lipstick I got. Oh, yes. From MAC. I thought it was going to be too dark. But you know what? No, that color is so I'm thinking good. I like this color. It's called Hug Me. You know me. I don't like dark lipstick or red. No, it looks perfect. But what do you think, guys? Yes. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. 
was a lot. It was a lot. It was a lot. So went so what went from a very planned out day to a crazy hot mess turned out to be productive yeah. and okay. Yeah. So it just goes to show you guys that sometimes plans can be broken, things can change. You can't have a meltdown. You just gotta go and step into plan B, plan C, plan D, whatever. Life is just that way. Yep. So I guess the lesson here, if there is a lesson, is just always know that nothing's set in stone. Things are always going to change, and you have to be able to be adaptable. So I guess I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Mr. Fab's information is going to be down below also. So if you're looking to get some makeup done this holiday season, he's your man. You know he's safe. Is that it? I think that's it. So until next time, bye bye.